The article entitled Cyclin D1 Gene Polymorphism in Egyptian Breast Cancer Women was published by Ibrahim Ham, EBI S.A., ABL Monimna and Hility in the Journal of Research in Biology, Volume 3, Issue 8 at pages 1111 to 1121. The summary of this article goes on as follows. Background, Cyclin D1, a key regulator of G1 to X phase progression of the cell cycle, is strongly established as an oncogene with an important pathogenetic role in many human tumors. Therefore any genetic variations that disturb the normal function of this gene product is ultimately a target for association with cancer risk and survival. Cyclin D1 silent mutation G870 in the splicing region of Xen4 enhances alternative splicing, resulting to CCMB1 mRNA transcripts variant A and B in which transcript B is a longer half-life. It has been deduced that G870A polymorphism of the CCMB1 gene may play a role in tumorigenesis. The aim of our study was to investigate the influence of CCNT1 genotypes on the genetic susceptibility to breast cancer in Egyptian population. Patients and Methods 80 newly diagnosed females representing Egyptian population confirmed breast cancer patients and 40 healthy controls were included in the study. Single nucleotide polymorphism SNT in CCNT1 G878 was determined in these samples by polymerase chain reaction, restriction fragment length polymorphism PCR SLP. Results the frequencies of AG, AA genotypes between patients group and the healthy control group have shown a significant difference at P equals 0009. Subjects less than 45 years of age with AA genotype were at decreased risk VDS ratio 0.438, 95% confidence interval 0.251 to 0.763 and postmenopausal subjects with AA genotype were at increased risk of developing breast cancer DDS ratio 5.056. 95% confidence interval 1.239 to 20.626. We found that breast cancer females carrying a layoff had longer DFS than did patients with GG genotype P equals 0001. Conclusion This study provides the first indication that CCMB1870 alleles AA slash AG genotypes are risk factors for breast cancer susceptibility in Egyptian women. Thus analysis of CCNT1 G878 polymorphism may be useful for identifying females with higher risk to develop breast cancer. You may also publish your research articles with us with good peer review and elite standards. Kindly visit www.jresearchbiology.com for further details. For submission, submit your articles to submit at jresearchbiology.com. Thank you for listening us. Keep watching and learn good. This audio was brought to you by www.arjal.org.